Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to add checkboxes to a document in Google Docs. So this is a newer feature that uh, makes it easier to add these types of checkboxes. So to do so, let's start a header first. Let's just say we're going to make a grocery list. Now let's say we want to add some checkboxes. So all you need to do is type an open and close square bracket like this. And then press space, not enter. You can see it adds a checkbox. So we could say bread. And then when you press enter, It'll go down a line and add another checkbox, and so on. Now let's say you want to end your checkbox. You can see it keeps going along here, so if you don't type anything and press enter again, then it'll remove the checkbox and put the uh, indent back to the original location here. And then of course if you change your mind, you want to add something, you come back at the end, press enter. Or if you want to add something in the middle, click on a line, press enter like so. Now let's say you want to move this over because you don't want it intended. You could just highlight it. Then you have the options here for in increase and decrease indent, but you'll see you could increase it. When you try and decrease it, it doesn't go back any farther. But what you could do is once you highlight it, uh, you could move the marker on the ruler here for the indent over to where you want it. Like so. So that's one way to get around that. All right, and then once you check a box, it'll put a check mark in it and then also add a strike through to the text. So I'm not a big fan of that. It'd be nice to be able to check the box without having it uh, cross out the text. And even if you highlight the text and you try and change it by clicking on strike through, it doesn't do anything to it. So it's not part of the text formatting. It's just part of doing the checkbox. So it's kind of unfortunate. There might be a way around it, but if so, I'm not sure how to do it. And so you can see I have the, the uh, strike through on there now because I actually formatted the text with it. So I could take that off. But when I check the box, it's back on. Okay, so once again, just uh, click anywhere you like. Do the open and close bracket. Press space bar. Type in your text. And then you press enter. It'll add a new checkbox. And then, of course, when you don't want to have any more checkboxes, just press enter again and it'll go away. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. Thank <laughs> you.